I'm making a video about my Vava Chroma. I saw the Vava was having a special on the internet, so I ordered. I thought I ordered a package, but I only receive the projector. I didn't feel too bad about it because I heard some people receive the screen only, even though they ordered a package. And I got in touch with Vava and they told me that I did not order the package. I just ordered the projector. So I have to wait and wait until I try to order it from Vava in the States and Vava told me that they don't ship to Canada. So I had to find another place in China that would sell me the 120. I end up paying a little more than what the Vava have in their package for the 120. But it's okay. Before I did not have a screen, I had to use the wall. So now I had my 120. And uh, before I had it, I had to work on my Vava to see what I can do. Because I spent too much money on the Vava to go and spend another 60 or $80 on another box just so I can watch some of those other programs. So I just work on my Vava myself to see what I can get. Because a lot of the apps did not work. Netflix did not work. And I did not want to... I already have the NVIDIA Shield. I have the Fire Stick 4K. And I didn't want to go buy another to, just to work on the Vava. So, here's what I did with my Vava, okay? As you can see, here's my Vava. I have all kind of apps on it now without using a different device. This is from the Vava itself, okay? This is Kodi. Before, it would only give me Kodi 9 it wouldn't give me Kodi 19.3 but I was able to fix that so I just want people to see that I read on the internet where Vava is coming up with a fix so I'll wait around for the fix but still I just want to let you guys know that stuff does work on Vava you know, these are some of the apps that I have directly on the projector itself. And it works. Even It's not the regular Netflix, but it does work. You know, that's all I got to say about that. Because I know how fussy YouTube is about showing stuff so I'm not gonna show any stuff that is gonna make YouTube any more fussier than they already is so I'm just letting you guys know that all these stuff works they all work I'm not gonna show you much detail or content but they work okay they all work. And all you need to help to get to these guys is this guy here. Once you got this guy here installed, you can get a lot of these other guys on your projector. Okay? That's what you need to do. Because when you want to find out what you have on your Vava Chroma, you need to find out what apps is working on your Vava Chroma. What app is on your Vava Chroma? How do I unlock my Vava Chroma? Let me show you this. Here's the settings here. You go here. You see what it shows you here? 
That's your vava. Okay? That's all on your vava. So I'm, not, I'm just making this little video, okay? So if there is anybody that is interested in how to get these apps on your Vava, you let me know and I'll post a video to show you how I did accomplish this because I don't see anybody showing how you get stuff on the Vava Chroma. I just see them telling you to use a second device. I already have the NVIDIA Shield. And if I stay, I don't want to go spend money on another machine. I spend too much money on the Vava. Okay? The Vava is more expensive than any TV that I ever bought. And I do not think that I should have to spend all that money, then spend another 80 or or $100 on another device. The Vava should provide all the things that I need. And that's why I'm not bothering putting any machine on the Vava Chroma. I want it to do all the job that it should do instead of a $30 machine can do something that this $4,000 machine can't do. That's not right. Okay? Vava should wake up and serve its customer more better than they are doing. They said there is a fix coming out. So I'm just gonna keep on doing what I'm doing and wait to see what the fix what the fix will add to this. Alright? Alright. Take care people.